So, I'm searching now uh, the house of the late Grandmaster Japan from after the period uh, that they took all his wealth. Maybe it's already broken down, but I'm really enjoying it because we're walking on the really old part of Patan, as you can see. It's amazing, yeah? It was all amazing to see the contrast, yeah? You see little old city, and then here we have the modern buildings. It's actually, in a way, quite sad, yeah? Uh, they will break this whole part down within the next few months, so it's really one of the last years that you can see the old flat sign like it used to be, at least in the building style. This is what they're going to build. Low density, luxurious residences. Actually, it will look quite nice in the future. Very beautiful, very modern. But all the old, nice, historical buildings From the time that the late Grandmaster Yipman walked in these streets are being torn down. So, actually, I'm sneaking past the guard here. I'm not allowed to come here, but I really want to find the house. So I'm still searching the house of the late Grandmaster Yipman and you see all around you, they destroyed this whole village uh, in the old part of Fatsan that he lived in and actually we are sneaking from behind trying to sneak in to the old part of the city but uh, there are everywhere security guards uh, keeping us away so don't know if it's going to work but let's hope and let's hope it's not already torn down. Literally walking through an old village in ruins. Huh? Like there's been a war here, war zone. Really quite sad. So, unfortunately, Sad to say that the house was really torn down, but uh, I have a picture for you guys from it. This was the house, right? and the old house of Grandmaster Yipman in Fatsan that he lived in after the Japanese uh, took over and took all his wealth. So this is actually the house he lived in when he was already poor. If you can see, this is the house or the state he lived in when he was rich, the ancestral home. A very big place. Also that was long time ago torn down. 